Hey everyone, welcome back to the Tenorshare channel. Tell me honestly, doesn't this new 3D wallpaper in iOS 26 look insane? It's like the lock screen is alive. But here's the catch, you only get this effect if you've updated to iOS 26. So if you're still on an older version, you might want to think twice about upgrading just for this. Now, let's get into how to set it up and make your iPhone look this cool. First, once you're on iOS 26, swipe down from the top to open Notification Center. Then, long press anywhere on the screen until the menu pops up. Tap the Customize button at the bottom, and that'll open the lock screen editor. Now just tap the screen to pick your favorite 3D wallpaper. Go for one with a clear main subject, so the depth effect really pops. Once you've chosen, hit the little icon next to the three dots in the bottom right. Your iPhone will take a few seconds to process it, and then boom, the 3D effect is on. Tilt your phone side to side, and you'll see the depth in action. Pretty cool, right? And if you want the effect to look even stronger, tap the three dots, choose depth effect, and you'll get an even deeper look. Just keep in mind, it might cover part of the time display, so you can resize the clock to make it fit better. And here's a tip, you can play around with widgets and lock screen accessories like I did. Just move things around until it feels comfortable to you. Sometimes, a simple setup makes the 3D effect stand out even more. Now, I know you might be wondering, where do I even get good 3D wallpapers? Don't worry, I've got you covered. I'll drop a few of my favorite sites in the description, so you can go test them out. And if you want the exact same wallpapers I used, also check the description links, or just search Tenorshare Inch on X website. You'll find plenty of options there. Before you go all in though, let's talk about a few things you should keep in mind. If you're using an iPhone 15 Pro or newer, you're good to go. But on older models, this effect can drain your battery faster. So maybe stick to static 3D wallpapers when you need to save power. Try to avoid wallpapers that are too bright or too busy. They'll make your lock screen text hard to read. Clean backgrounds with a clear subject look way better. And because iOS 26 has that liquid glass UI style, super flashy colors or messy patterns can clash with the notification panel. Simpler is usually better here. So yeah, iOS 26 really leveled up the wallpaper game. Go try it out, play around with different photos, and let me know in the comments which wallpaper style looks best on your iPhone. And hey, if you found this helpful, don't forget to subscribe. I've got more iOS 26 tricks coming your way soon. See you next one.